Tum 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 tum. Hey everybody, CK here, and I'm coming to you guys with another video. I should just have this little disclaimer that rolls across the screen and just says, I'm super excited right now, and this is the reason I'm in it. Because y'all know I always get like super hyped when I film. So, anyway, I'm excited, number one, because I love talking to y'all, you know what I mean? And then, number two, why do I always have, see, that's the teacher in me, the one, two, three, one, two, three, four. No, okay. Seriously, though, I am super duper excited, you guys, because I have the Makeup Geek Highlighter Collection to show y'all and I'm wearing it right now well not it because it's like 13 of them but I'm wearing one of them right now and surprisingly it's a duochrome now I'm gonna get to this highlight and I'm gonna show y'all in a second but listen this right here on my cheek and in my inner corner is the same highlight I'll give you a second just like digest that like really it's the same it's duochrome so it looks kind of peachy right here and then it gives me a gold look right here I just love so before we get deep into this video you guys i want to let you know that i did not i repeat i did not film a makeup look on this tutorial right here what no before we get started i want to let you guys know that i didn't film a tutorial on this makeup look i have everything that i'm rocking in the description box but i do want to let you know that i am rocking a new lippy by ofra cosmetics it should be launching today i think by the time you see this video it will be launching and y'all know that I love, love, love their liquid lippies. And this is in the color Bordeaux. I don't have on a lip liner or anything. It's just a straight up lippy. And um, let's just say I'm in love. We are about to get lit on today. Did y'all see the title? I said it's lit. Not only are we going to talk about the Makeup Geek highlighters, but I do want to let you guys know that I will have another video on highlighters that I received from Cover FX. Uh, makeup forever and Mac, but I didn't want to make this video like a whole movie just saying okay so let's go first of all they are in these adorable packages like it's really cute and only thing you can really get some fingerprints on that thing I tried to wipe them off a little bit before I did this video but if you see fingerprints don't judge me it's similar to the packaging on their blushes except for this is a square shape and then the blushes are circular i'm going to show you this one because this one seems to be my favorite so far and this is in the color of blaze and it has a mirror too like how cool is that i mean you're set but there you go would y'all have guessed that this is the color that i have on would you have guessed like it's totally like an orange coppery type of look now i'm not good at describing colors but i do have a paper that tells me all the info <gasps> I was right. It says copper base with golden duochrome reflex. This shade is best suited for deep skin tones. One thing that I have really been loving about Makeup Geek and their launches that they've done lately, um, whether it be blushes, whether it be contour shades, and whether it be even the highlighters, is that they let you know what skin tone they made it for. Not saying that you have to stick to that and you can't use whatever you want, however you want, but I like the fact that they give us a guide for people that are not into makeup, such as myself or people that are just starting out or whatever the case may be. That's a great guide. And it totally sounds like I work for Makeup Geek right now, but I'm telling y'all, this video is not sponsored. I wish it was, but it's not. But yes, they did send me all these products, okay? Back to a blaze. Let's swatch that baby. I haven't done this in a long time. A blaze. Oh, how I love thee. Look at that. So this next shade right here is Firework. And don't forget, I will have pictures at the end. But it says that Firework is a true copper with a reflective luminous finish. This shade is best suited for deep skin tones. And this is a highlighter, a regular highlighter. It's not a duochrome. Now, the other day when I was getting ready on Snapchat, I did like a snap tutorial, like my first one ever. And I was like, which one should I wear? I it was like out of four of them. I couldn't decide, but I went with the blaze and... I had to go with it again because, oh my gosh, it's just bomb. But anyway, there you go. This is firework right here. So this next one right here, you guys, if you follow me on Snapchat, you know that one of them were damaged in transit, okay? And I was like, man down, man down, man down. I, I didn't, I just, I had a moment on Snapchat, but... I was able to salvage it. I totally tried to keep some of the print right here, hashtag fail, but it's all good. It's definitely usable now. And all I did was use alcohol, but this is the color Ignite. Now this right here, like I said on Snap, it is pretty much like my skin tone with like 
some shimmer or some, not shimmer, but some glaze, some sheen. You feel what I mean? So if you're deeper than myself, this will work too, real good. Now we're moving into the shades for medium skin tone. And this one is psychedelic. And it really is like an off-white color in the pan, okay? So what you see is pretty much what I'm seeing. And it's not much until it comes on your hand. It's pretty bomb. I actually wanted to use this one too. I didn't know which one I should use. Now, here we go. Look at that. It's off-white in the pan, but that joker comes off like peachy. That's why I'm like, I need to use this one too. So I don't know which one I'm gonna use in a get ready with me, but it's gonna be one of these babies. And it's not gonna be a blaze because I'm abusing it right now. Like I've used it a lot already. It says that Psychedelic is a peach base with pink duochrome reflex. This shade is suited for medium skin, as I said. So there's Psychedelic right there. And this next one is Daybreak. This is a little more peachy than what the camera is giving me, but this is called Daybreak. And this is a regular highlighter, but this is a little bit silver on me, but this is for medium skin tone. So let me read you what this says it is. It says it's a soft peach with a reflective luminous finish. I love this highlighter formula because it is not like a glittery type formula. Like when you put it on, you don't have a bunch of glitter reflex popping off your cheek. You know what I mean? I do not like glittery highlighters, especially the glitter gets all over your face. Like I'm not really feeling those type of highlighters. Now I'll use them for the inner corner, but I like these because it's more of like a sheen and it's just gorgeous. I don't know what else to say, but this one is Rekindle. And this is the one that many me wore on Snapchat. If y'all follow me, it's gorgeous. It looks like they're coming off similar on camera, but this one is definitely not as silver on me as this one is right here, but it does have a peach undertone, but let's see what the paper says, because I'm not really good at describing it, but it, oh, See, there you go. It's a rose gold with a reflective luminous finish. And this is for medium skin tones. And this is just a regular highlighter. It's not duochrome. Y'all makeup makes me so happy. So this color, Electrify. And it looks kind of yellow in the pan. That's basically what you get. But when you swatch that baby, oh, but when you swatch that baby. I'm doing old school swatching for y'all. Do y'all see how pretty that is? It is like a, you could use these for eyeshadows if you want to too, I'm saying. Marlena, girl. You did that. So it says, cause I'm getting distracted here. It says that it's a translucent base with butter yellow duochrome reflex. And this is for fair skin, but I will rock it. Yes, I would. I don't even care. But this one is lit. It's lit. This is similar to, it is very similar to Electrify, but they come off a little bit different. And this is a duochrome as well. And it's hard to really show this on camera because it's kind of white. It's kind of getting washed out. But oh, but when you swatch that baby. But this right here is lit. Is it lit? It's lit. It's lit. It's a translucent base with peachy pink duochrome reflex. And this is for fair skin. Pause. Now my whole highlighter collection by Makeup Geek is complete. Like this is the Kathleen Lights highlighter collection that they did with her, the collaboration. And I'll swatch these at the end too, because I want to see if they're similar to any of the ones that are on my arm already. So this next color is Luster. Now let's swatch that baby. This is a regular highlighter. It's not a duochrome. And you know, people wear those like rainbow highlighters, I guess for editorial pictures or for whatever reason, for Instagram photos or whatever, but you could totally make your own rainbow highlight with a a lot of these colors and you'll see you'll see because it's coming but this is luster right there luster is a rosy tan with a reflective luminous finish and it is for fair skin tones now we're getting into like the rainbow colors well like for my skin tone anyway but this is celestial there you go that kind of shows you but this baby i really should have wore this today in my inner corner to go with my purple but anyway let's swatch it this one talk about this one talk about look do y'all see how it has like purple reflex in it. Ooh. It says it's a white base with icy violet duochrome reflex. And this is for porcelain skin, but this is midnight sun. And let me show you, it's just a gold color. Like girl, I can rock this. So this is a soft champagne with a reflective luminous finish. And this is for fair skin. I skipped over one of the fair skins, but there you go. Now you guys let me know in the comment section, what shade I should rock in my Get Ready With Me tutorial. Cause y'all know I like to use a bunch of new products in some of my Get Ready With Me's and I definitely wanna use one of these, but I want y'all to help me. All right, so this next color is Moon Phase. It's another one that looks kind of white in the pan. 
I'm not going to even guess the undertone of this. I started to say blue. I totally started to say blue, but this is moon phase right here. And then it says that moon phase is a white base with icy blue. Eh, I was right. Icy blue and purple duochrome reflex. And this is for porcelain skin. And the last one is called glitz. Now this definitely has a pink, kind of pink, violet, purple type situation going on. There you go, right there, glitz. Glitz and glamor. It is a icy pink with a reflective luminous finish and this is for porcelain skin tones. Now we are gonna swatch this baby. I don't know where in the world I'm gonna put them. I mean, I guess we can put them on the side or something. I have no idea how we're gonna do this. I didn't think this through, but listen, <laughs> this is the Makeup Geek and Kathleen Lights collaboration. This was the, or these I should say, were the first highlighters that they released. This one is Sunlight, this one is Starlight, and this one is Nightlight. Fave right here, fave. Oh Lord, I didn't think this through. But there is sun, sunlight. Oh, that is blinging. It may be kind of close to the very first one that I swatched, which was a blaze. It's similar, but they're not the same. And I don't think that they would make them the same knowing that they're coming out with the set. And then the next color is starlight. That's a really pretty color. I'm gonna let y'all be the judge. Let me know, does anything look similar? It's real hard for me. <laughs> it's hard for me to do it from this standpoint. And then finally, Nightlight, we lit y'all, but that's nightlight. And I don't see anything on here that looks like nightlight. And also stay tuned for the swatches where I just did it with the camera, just in case the quality is a little bit different in case you're not getting like the full effect of it. But you guys make sure that you subscribe, all right? So you don't miss my upcoming videos and just click that little button and join the family because I would love to have you over here. We have a lot of fun over here, y'all. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for hanging out with me on today. If you enjoyed this video or it helped you make your decision on what you are gonna buy, don't forget to thumbs up. And until the next video, y'all have an awesome, blessed day. And I will see you sooner than you think. Bye. Oh, don't you break my highlighter, girl. Oh! Woo! <gasps> I'm a bad highlighter, mom. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Keep you neat, confidence is key. You know what I mean. A woman feels good when she's looking pretty. I don't need no Benz, Lexus, or a Range Rover. Just give your girl a bomb, see, keep beauty makeover. Confidence is key, ladies, you know what I mean. Or maybe her eyeshadow and mascara will help you see. Check out her foundation and the blush on her cheek. Yeah, we ain't playing games, it's the Seeky Beauty. Yeah, Seeky Beauty.